all of the autoimmune, osteoporosis, arthritis. Um, my joints were destroyed. I've had my legs cut in two and turned around. I've had a hip replacement. I live with chronic pain since I was 40. I had tried the Western medicine and exhausted uh, the medicines damaged. Um, I had worked with chemicals, so I lived in mold, chemicals, you name it, I had it. Um, I had been going to the dentist because I had dry mouth and I was losing my teeth. When they check your bone, you know how they take that little pick and they test it. I always showed number nines, eights and nines. When I started in June, after it was time for my annual checkups, doctor, dentist, eye doctor. So this is all done in January. So first off, the dentist said, my goodness, your gums have grown back and, and your bone density is two. <laughs> so that made me a candidate to have all my teeth replaced since they had been damaged with all the chemicals. So a month ago, I have all new teeth and uh, the bone is growing right around as it should the uh, titanium implants. So that was a win-win. Wow. Um, then when I went to the doctor for my annual checkup, um, he tested as they do all the blood work. And he said, my gosh, what have you been doing? You have the blood oh, work God. of a 50 year old. Your lungs are great. Your heart is great. You have perfect blood pressure. And by the way, I'm 78 years old as of January. So um, my hip, I went back to have my hip uh, checked. I had a hip replacement a year ago in July. It's phenomenal. I have no issues with it. I'm at the gym. I'm walking. Uh, I'm lifting weights. I'm stretching, exercise, yoga, those kind of things. Um, let me see. The eye doctor also, I had been living with a wrinkled retina, so uh, the lines were wavy. I'd had that for about five years. And last year, he said, you had the beginnings of macular degeneration. And I had a vision of about 30, 40 in both eyes. So at the test, he said, oh, your eyes are better. You no longer need restasis. You don't need drugs for dry eyes. I don't see any macular degeneration. The wrinkled retina looks like it might even be better. And I have 20-20 vision in my left eye and 20-30 uh, in my right eye. So those are three doctors just down and away. I don't even have to go back for a year. <laughs> So let me see. I have so many good things. Um, the patches worked for me right away. The pain helped. Uh, it felt, in the first four hours, I felt like deep heat had been rubbed on all my joints. They felt cool and no heat. Uh, inflammation was great. Um, no brain fog. Uh, my skin firmed up. Uh, my hair color started getting darker again. It used to be white, white. Uh, let me see. Oh, I have to tell, can I tell about the dog, Charity? Do we have time? Yeah, sure. Uh, but I first want to ask you a question, BG, because, um, you know, when I seen you two years ago, before I was introduced to the patches, um, well, it actually would have been two years now, uh, close. You could hardly walk with all the pain that you, and you had tried everything. Um, and now, I mean, you just went on a trip. You were standing in line to get a rental car for over three hours. You had no problem. This is absolutely phenomenal because of what stem cells again do to go into heal and repair. Would you, do you want to comment on that just briefly? I, I will. Um, I also was a candidate for knee replacements. They did the hip first. And so you saw me just before I did anything and uh, I could hardly walk. Uh, I had to be help myself to get out of a chair and couldn't walk very far and couldn't stand even to do dishes was so painful. So uh, the hip replacement was a success. I did the hip replacement before I started the stem cells, but after I started the stem cells, 
uh, I don't think I'm going to have to have the knees replaced. It's bone on bone and I have a, had a spur, but um, all the joints are better. I still have a crooked finger that I'm working on, but I have flexibility and not much pain and not much inflammation that shows, you know, how you swell. My knees were like watermelons before on them. And uh, that inflammation has gone down. So I, it's, I'm a new woman. I'm a little bit bionic now, but I am totally young, like a 50 year old, happy. Uh, I must say the Eon is my happy patch. I wear mine during the day because I like to feel that. It does help me sleep at night too, but I want it during the day. So I'm wearing X39 now since our last convention. X49 and Eon. And um, I did through my, when I had pain right after the surgery, my leftover patches, I put all kinds of uh, ice wave, Eon, <laughs> glutathione. I just looked lovely at night, but I did not have to use pain killers one day. Wow. One day. That is amazing. And the, it went down fast. I'm getting around great. Um, and in my gym, they are offering Zumba, so I can even do a little Zumba. <laughs> that is absolutely incredible. And BG, you know, I've known you for years. And like I said, um, it's hard to even catch you anymore because you're on the run or you're going here or going there. And, um, you know, these, these patches just simply give your, our life back. And you also were one of my friends who had stem cells um, prior and, um, you know, we had had them before. And um, so these are just working so incredibly for you and uh, so excited. Um, wow, what a testimony. I, I believe it's God's gift, as you are to me. And uh, I'm not going to be without them. <laughs> I'm in it. <laughs> yeah, uh, I'm, we're all there with you. So um, thank you so much. We'll, we'll circle back around in a couple months and uh, hear some more testimonies of what they're doing for you, because it's just, um, again, a miracle and what just healing and repairing from the inside out. Um, so Kathleen, I think wow. you have a couple more testimonies for us. I do. Wow. BG, thank you so much for sharing your story and you are, the chat is just blowing up with how gorgeous and radiant <laughs> you look and how your skin is so beautiful. Absolutely amazing. <laughs> Yes. Thank you so much. Once again, an absolutely mind-blowing, life-changing experience. So thank you so much. So I'm going to ask my 